Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Peyton. I'm so excited because today's video is going to be a review of the brand new Shark Flex Fusion hair tool. I'm going to show you the different pieces and attachments that come with the Flex Fusion, and I'm also going to show you a couple different hairstyles you can do using all one tool. I've been a fan of Shark Tools for a while. I first tried out the Flex Style two years ago. I bought it for myself after Christmas with my Christmas money. I use this thing multiple times a week. I use it to blow dry my hair and curl my hair, and it's kind of like the everyday hair that you guys do see me with. It is Done with my flex style. I've also used the shark smooth style for several different hairstyles. If you guys are going for a more straight, sleek style hair, this one's really good. All that said, the Flex Fusion actually combines all of my favorite features from the two into one tool, which is amazing because I don't know about you guys, but I hate having multiple tools because it just feels like overwhelming to try to pack it when I'm going on trips. It also just feels like a lot of things in my closet that takes up space. So now having one tool that combines these great features is amazing. So opening up the box, this is the main piece of the Flex Fusion. At first glance, it looks almost identical to the Flex style. There are a couple small differences though that I noticed between the two tools. This one, the Flex Fusion, is a little bit smaller and it also has a couple different button changes. We'll get into some of the specifics, but the main one here is that it changes depending on if you're starting with wet or damp hair or styling your hair with dry hair. So this is kind of what Shark is known for with protecting your hair as much as possible from any sort of heat damage. And for the attachments, we have the Fusion Straightener, Fusion Wet or Dry Styler, Styling Concentrator, and lastly our left and right auto wrap hair curlers. They come in a 1.25 inch barrel and they also look a little bit different than the Flex Style barrels. So you guys can see these have a little bit more crevices, a little bit more texture, and these are a little bit smoother all the way around. Like I said, I wanna show you guys a couple different hairstyles using this one tool because I have used it a few times and honestly, I think it's really, really good. The only things I have in my hair right now are this IGK prep spray and the JVN styling milk. So just so you guys know what the prep is on my hair before we get into styling. Just threw the top layer of my hair up and right now we are going to straighten my hair with the Fusion Straightener. So that's this attachment. It clicks onto this piece the way all the other shark ones do where you kind of line up the arrows and then it snaps right into place. You can use it on wet or dry hair. Right now I'd say my hair is like 70% dry. I've been air drying it for like the past 30 minutes or so. My goal here is to get completely stick, no flyaway hair, and I want to show you guys exactly how that works. Over my hair and sort of passing over about inch, two inch size pieces. Here's how it looks with both sides straightened. I love that it's one tool to blow dry your hair and straighten it. Literally at the same time, it makes things so easy not to have multiple things you're doing. It feels super soft and just honestly healthy. I feel like I'll be wearing my hair straight a little bit more often. For the second hairstyle, I'm going to use the Fusion Wet or Dry Styler, which kind of gives your hair a little bit of bounce. It's giving like the Rachel Green hairstyle from Friends. Also, side note, I'm going to leave the top of my hair up for now so it stays a little bit damp to show you guys the third and final hairstyle right after this. Because my hair is already dry, I'm going to use this one actually on the dry setting. As you guys can see, there's this little flashing light right now. Once it turns fully green, that means it's ready. This is how you know this is heated up and ready to style. Here's one side done. As you guys can see, it's a very subtle little flip, a little curl right on the end of my hair without again being full on ringlets and full on all the way top to bottom curls. Now here's the second side again, super smooth with just a little bit of flip, a little bit of character at the end. And for the third and final hairstyle, I clipped the bottom of my hair back and brought down the damp top of it finally, and we are going to curl my hair. I say my hair is about 80 to 90% dry up here, so I'm going to use my two different barrels and I'm going to curl each side of my hair. So we're going to start with the right side first. Since my hair is wet, I'm going to be using it on wet mode. I'm letting the heat be on my hair for 10 seconds and then I'm pressing the cold button where it shoots out cold air and that's the best way that shark recommends to actually avoid heat damage on your hair this is one side done after i finish this side i'm going to brush this side through i like to let the ringlets kind of sit and hold for a minute and i find that my hair stays curled throughout the day and the next day even now here's this side done too so i'm going to take my under hair out which obviously is not going to match the ringlets up here but i just want to show you guys a complete ish hairstyle this looks kind of crazy but i wanted to show you guys all the different hairstyles on different parts of my hair so let me just brush this right through honestly i'm pretty impressed considering i used three different hairstyling attachments to complete this look i'm sure after all that you guys can tell i am a big fan of the shark flex fusion after trying the three different tools that i have 
I will say I think this one combines the best of both worlds from the smooth style and the flex style where you can wear your hair straight, you can style it wavy, you can style it curly. You also can just use this simply as a blow dryer and not add any of the attachments to it as well. So if you guys don't have any of the Shark tools yet, I would actually recommend going with the Flex Fusion. If you have the Flex style, I personally don't think you need to swap that in or upgrade to the Flex Fusion. I think the Flex style does a really great job at everything you do need. This is kind of just like the next step a little bit better, a little bit more updated because it has been a few years since that was created compared to this. For price points, this one is the highest price point of the three. It's at $350 as of today. Flex style is $300 on the Shark website and then the Smooth style is under $100. That brings us to the end of today's video. I hope you guys liked this review and kind of seeing how this new Shark tool works. If you do have any questions or you want more information on any of these, I'm always responding to comments on here. I'm responding to DMs on Instagram and TikTok. Talk, so feel free to message me and I will definitely get back to you. If you haven't already, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, turn on that little notification bell, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!